With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hi everyone. So we are given with a question which says a capacitor is made of a flat plate having area capital A and a second plate having stair like structure as shown in the figure. The width of each stair is given as small a and the height is given as small b. We need to find capacitance of the assembly. So here if we carefully analyze we can see uh, the whole of area that is uh, the area of plate is been divided can be divided into three capacitor that is we can say this can be the first capacitor this can be considered to be our second capacitor and this can be considered to be as third capacitor and as we can see uh, the area is getting divided between the plates so uh, we need to uh, we can see that three capacitors are in parallel so uh, by parallel combination formula we can write equivalent capacitance can be written as c1 plus c2 plus c3 so now we have to calculate c1 c2 and c3 so for that uh, we know uh, capacitance formula is given by a epsilon 0 by d when there is no dielectric medium present in between the two plates so we uh, we have the formula of capacitance as a epsilon 0 by d so let's say this is our, uh, our let's say this is our equation number 1 and using this equation that is uh, c equals to a epsilon 0 by d we will calculate c1 c2 and c3 so if we uh, carefully analyze the area of this plate is a by 3 area of this plate is a by 3 and area of this plate is a by 3 just we can see the separation is getting changed all right so we can write and d is the separation between the plates here from the formula we can see a is the area d is the separation between the two plates so for capacitance one we can write that is now we can say c1 can be written as area has become a by 3 epsilon 0 d that is distance between the two plate is d only as we can see so it is d now similar way we will calculate uh, for c2 area is again a by 3 over here all right since it has been given as total uh, 3a and each length is given as a a and a so it will be area will be 3 a by 3 a by 3 and a by 3 all right so area will get equally divided into uh, for all the three capacitor similarly uh, we can write here epsilon 0 and the distance between two plates uh, can be clearly seen b plus d so here we will write distance between the two plate will be b plus d and similarly we can find it for c3 so here we can see area is a by 3 again epsilon 0 and finally we can see the separation between two plates will be uh, this distance uh, will be d plus b and again it is b so 2b plus d finally we can say 2b plus d the separation between the two plate will be this all right and as we can see the separation for each capacitance is constant for this it is 2b plus d for this capacitor is b plus d for this it is d separation is constant throughout so uh, we can uh, say that this will be all the three capacitors uh, will be in parallel so uh, we can uh, remember this whenever we can say the separation is getting divided so the capacitor comes into series and whenever uh, area gets divided so capacitor comes into parallel and we have applied the parallel combination formula over here so now we can finally write we have to just substitute the value to get the c equivalent that is c1 we have calculated it as a by 3 epsilon 0 by d let's write it a bit clearly plus a epsilon 0 by 3b plus d and finally we can write a epsilon 0 by 3 into 2b plus d so if we uh, solve it further we can take a epsilon 0 by 3 as common out so what we are left with is uh, 1 over d plus 1 over b plus d plus 1 over 2b plus d on further simplification uh, we can say this can be written as a epsilon 0 by 3 this can be written as 
टू डी प्लस बी अपॉन डी इन टू बी प्लस डी प्लस वन अपॉन टू बी प्लस डी और राइट सो इफ यू फर्दर सिंप्लीफाइड वी कैन गेट ए एफ सेवन जीरो बाय थ्री एंड यर इट कैन बी रिटर्न एस टू बी डी प्लस टू डी स्क्वायर प्लस टू बी स्क्वायर प्लस बी डी प्लस बी डी प्लस डी स्क्वायर जस्ट वी हैव क्रॉस मल्टीप्लाई द टू टर्म्स एंड फाइनली डिवाइडिंग इट बाय uh we can write d into b plus d into 2b plus d and here it is 4bd because 2b into 2d it is 4bd so finally the answer comes out to be a epsilon 0 by 3 into here it can be seen that 2d square plus d square is 3d square plus 6 bd that is 4bd plus bd plus bd it will be 6bd and plus 2b square dividing by d into b plus d into 2b plus d all right so this is the final answer to this question i hope you have understood the concept and thank you for watching for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today